from CVS. I had to pick up a print from CVS. And I'm really excited for this print. So I printed out words of affirmation to put in the frames that I have in my bedroom and my bathroom. So this is one of them. This one, this one is by Peter Hollins. And this one's by Napoleon Hill. Napoleon Hill is one of my favorite authors. Then I got some script ones. This one's by James, James Clare. He wrote the book um, Atomic Habits. And this one is also by James. I did four? I mean five? Oh, apparently I did five. This one's also by James Clare. And or did I did two of one? They gave me an extra print. Okay. And then this one is also by James Clare. So I'm going to mix and match. This is going to be like my main quote for the year. It says, if you can get 1% better each day for one year, you'll end up 37 times better by the time you're done. So I may not have done my best with my habits these last couple of days, but the goal is consistency. So I think I'm going to put this one in the bathroom, these two in the bathroom, and I'm going to put these two in my bedroom so i'll show you guys the prints that i recently got in because i also just got these and i'll just show you guys um the different prints i got around the house for me that represents growth where i want to be this idea of becoming new or becoming someone else becoming a better version of myself <laughs> You ain't picking your phone up Why you messing my head up? Any night, any day Let me take you away All I need is just saying yeah, 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 yeah Better nights, better days When you're here with me, babe Cause you're all that I crave So I wonder Where are you? Where are you? Don't hide away from me when I need you most We got love guaranteed and I have to know Say, where are you? Where are you? Where are you? Don't be so hard to reach Just pick up your phone Tell me where you be Cause I gotta know Let me know when you're ready Cause I made reservations Too many invitations And the last night was heavy. heavy I need communication Tell me where's your location Used to talk 24-7 Every other second Guys, I feel so good right now I started doing my habits today Today's the first day So like my morning routine Or when I wake up routine Cause you know I wake up at like 4 o'clock in the afternoon Cause I work overnight i like to keep my schedule consistent when i'm off so last night i planned what i want to do for today and kind of wrote out habits that i want to accomplish daily and one of them was to wake up no phone in bed did that i did my am beauty routine even though it's nighttime i did my face brushed my teeth and i put on some makeup today you know i think i look cute got on my cute robe and my pajamas i love these pajamas that i got i got them from anthropology i started my routine around 4 30. i spent 30 minutes doing my um doing my five minute journal and updating my productivity journal so i'm gonna have some 
eggs and potatoes for breakfast. I've been eating this super simple and cheap meal because I've been a little lazy about cooking because I want to go to the gym after work. But you guys know I work super, I work overnight. So after work is like, what is that like? Six o'clock in the morning, go to the gym right after work. Oh, so what do you take for vitamins? Okay, so yesterday I took a different batch of vitamins, but then I realized like, girl, you got this prenatal vitamin for a reason. So I got this prenatal vitamin here from My Kind Organics. And I know you guys are like, why are you taking prebiotics? No, I'm not pregnant. No, I don't want to get pregnant. But these prebiotics, I said prebiotics. Did I call these prebiotics the whole time? These prenatal vitamins literally have all of the vitamins that you need, okay? Has vitamin A, has vitamin C, has vitamin D, has vitamin E, has vitamin K, has vitamin B12, has vitamin B6. It has riboflovines, <laughs> can't say that right, fulfate. It has biotin, it has iron, iodine, zinc, selenium, magnesium, chlorinium. It has all of it. And I was looking for all of those in a vitamin. But what I realized is that the woman's vitamin doesn't necessarily have all of that in it. So I'm like, I'll just take this. If this is good enough for a baby, this is good enough for me. Okay. So I got this vitamin instead. I know it's a little different, but I really don't care. I also take this brain booster. Um, I used to take this a lot when I was going, when I was back in school. This is kind of like Adderall in a, in a vitamin form. And I really like this. I do feel like this gives me a brain booster. Um, it makes it focus on memory, focus, and clarity. So here it is. You can get this on Amazon. And then the last vitamin that I'm taking in the, is this woman's vitamin. Um, this is a woman saw palamento vitamin. Um, do I remember the health benefits? I don't remember the health benefits of this, but they're pretty good. But it pretty much says support drive, energy and mood, healthy hair, skin and nails with biotin and macro root. So I know the prenatal vitamins also have biotin in it, but that's okay. <laughs> Just eat, go easy on yourself. 
So I think I'm going to transfer these last three things on my to-do that I did not finish to the next to-do list. So let's just do it. I'm like I'm already here. videos like this with my fitness journey and pretty much you know gaining weight and muscle and being fit because you know I'm in my <laughs> should I tell you guys how old I am I'm in my 30s and you know I feel like I need to take control of my life I need to be proactive of it and um my goal is to pretty much be fit, become the best person that I can possibly be. So I want to definitely get my fitness in check, which, you know, I just want to get my fitness in check and then increase my meals as my fitness gets in check. I just want to be more, I just want to be more cut and toned. So my goal is to do that, you know, have a better body, love myself. I love myself, but love myself more. Um, I have some problem areas that I want to, you know, address. I'll probably address that with you guys, you know, with my skin and stuff like that. I just feel like I need to take better control of my life and do the things that I need to do for me so I can feel successful and happy. And these little things that I'm doing are is definitely helping me achieve that level of feeling successful in my life even if it's small steps like for me these small steps with my a.m. beauty routine my p.m. beauty routine and doing things on my habit tracker are literally like the small wins that I need so I can feel good about myself and even if I'm not accomplishing all those 10 goals in my habit tracker the fact that I'm doing 1% a day is really really good that's going to be if I can do that consistently over over the year that's going to be three 37 times more that's going to be 37 times more beneficial for me 1% every single day is what I'm striving for little by little little by little little by little little by little I'm the turtle I'm slowly moving but I'm moving I'm tired of being the fox tired of being the fox and I've been the fox in the past Russian ain't going nowhere but Russian <laughs> so that was a good analogy that was a good one so we're going to keep tackling along turtle by turtle maybe she, maybe I should get an image of a turtle in my bathroom I'm sorry I keep bringing it up but I still can't believe my stuff got stolen I am really upset right now so for the last two days I've been at work working and because I have an overnight schedule I work later in the day work out you know and my packages have literally been delivered around 6 30 you know I come home from my morning shift or from my night shift in the morning and my packages are fucking gone twice Okay, it happened on Wednesday, it happened on Thursday. My plant that I've been waiting for, my expensive plant, disappeared from my front door. There's a picture of it that UPS took of them delivering my plant at my front door because they bring it to the front door, which I thoroughly appreciate. The UPS guys always ring the bell, but I wasn't home to pick it up. So I'm upset because this is the second time in a row. That happened on Thursday. On Wednesday, the exact same thing happened. My package got delivered at 617. Like, why couldn't you guys be like an hour earlier? I'm not blaming the UPS people or the people doing shipment because it's not their fault that my packages keep getting missing or keep going missing. It's the people that live in this apartment building that are the thieves. So I've come up with a grand idea to catch the thief in the act, okay? And like, it's so crazy. I'm so content without those items to the point that I don't even think I'm gonna buy it. But I feel like I have to buy it to prove to myself that I can buy this tenfold. 
you just got to respond differently. Right? And maybe it's a good thing. Maybe this is a good thing. I'm looking at the positive. I can get a P.O. box. Make me official content creator here on YouTube. Getting my P.O. box. Right? I can get a P.O. box. I can put my P.O. box in my videos. And who knows? Maybe people send me things. I like cute things. I'm a little bougie. Don't be sending me no cheap.